If you're looking for a fun place to talk with myself and a lot of other very cool people, my Ninjago Discord server is the perfect place. There we can discuss Ninjago and lots of other very cool things. If you're interested, the link can be found at the top of the description. So a slightly higher quality image of the new Benthomar minifigure has been leaked out to us, and so I thought it would be in my best interest to make a brief video covering this new image, as I for one think that this figure does look really, really cool. I'm not going to waste any more of your time here, so let's get straight into it, and let's talk about it. Okay, so starting right up at the top with the hair, he uses the new Joker hairpiece in black this time, which I think works really, really well. And then, as for the whole figure, it's pretty much in this sand blue kind of colour, which I actually really like the look of. Um, for the face, it has a jewel face, actually, which is really, really cool. I like both of them, but I do think I prefer the one on the right, if I'm being honest here. And then, as for the torso, I'm actually pleasantly surprised. It's got a lot of detail. It looks extremely show accurate, to be fair to them, which, you know, props to LEGO for actually managing to pull that off. And, um, yeah, I really love the gold detailing. And, of course, the muscle detailing, that goes together quite nicely. And, as you can see, there's the gold chains there. He is also wielding this gold trident kind of thing, which looks pretty nice. And, um, yeah, as for the legs, same design pretty much. You've got the, um, the sand blue with the gold detailing at the top there with the gold belt, which does look really, really nice. And I believe in, like, the middle of the legs, that's a bronzy kind of colour. So that's quite unusual for a lego figure so you know that's a nice thing to to kind of get on this figure here so um yeah this one does look pretty nice and i cannot wait to get my hands on it when it does eventually release so overall this new benthamar minifigure does actually look really really good and for that figure alone i do think the temple is kind of worth picking up if you are that interested in it because it is a cool minifigure and it is exclusive so, um, yeah, good luck if you do actually buy that set. Um, I hope you like it. And, yeah, that's really all I wanted to say in this quick news update here, guys. If this video was informative, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Do all of that stuff. It helps me out a lot. And we've been growing a lot recently. And I am truly grateful for all of your support. With all of this being said, though, I will see you all in my next one coming out very, very soon.